Hi, my name is Igor Kolodov. This is Introduction to Computer Forensics, also known as Digital Forensics. I welcome you to the course. This is our e-learning homepage, but I'm not using e-learning for our online materials. For most of the work in this course, we will be using an alternative website, which is cisweb.bristolcc.edu. You need to email me directly to get your access. One exception here is the discussion forum. Here in e-learning, I recommend that you subscribe right here to this discussion forum and create new thread as necessary and post your questions here. Be sure to subscribe because if new questions or answers are posted, you will be notified by email. Back to the welcome screen. I am now clicking on the link to our home page. You can find this page through these URLs. CIS Web is a dedicated computer information systems department server where we keep uh, our materials. I recommend that you bookmark this page for your convenience. So this is the link to our course, Introduction to Computer Forensics. And this is the portal that I'm asking you to email me to get your credentials. Here's our main menu on our weekly schedule right here under weekly assignments. We'll have links to reading materials and handouts as they apply to every current week. We also have links to reading materials and handouts, which I'm opening now. Uh, we have some book copies reserved for this course, and uh, our first reading assignment will be uh, using this book, Incident Response and Computer Forensics 3rd Edition. I have, have it here in PDF format, and just be sure that when uh, you're looking for a specific chapter, you can always uh, um, use the bookmarks and expand, and it will provide you this good detailed uh, index to jump to a specific part of the book. In addition to this, we'll have uh, links posted to, on a weekly basis to various handouts on this list. And next week we will begin working on laboratory exercises, uh, which involve hands-on work with different forensic tools. One of the tools you, you can see here is Autopsy Digital Forensics, and we'll have uh, a detailed coverage on how to install it and start using it on your home machine. Back to the main menu, we also have a series of video links in this course. Since you're watching this video, I assume you already found CIT 155 YouTube channel. And new videos will be added here on a regular basis. We also have a series of YouTube lectures by Brian Carrier, one of the creators of Autopsy. And it covers a training course on different parts of Autopsy software. So we'll be uh, closely following a lot of this training materials as we move through our practical uh, laboratory exercises. There is also an excellent YouTube channel from uh, Professor Joshua James at Hallam University, South Korea, and it offers excellent uh, choices of topics for digital forensics. Another important tool for us to use is FTK Imager. We'll have a couple of practical exercises using it as well. Back to the main menu. Soon we're going to start using forensic images for our hands-on exercises. And of course we have a link to our syllabus. Please download and save it for your records. Of course it includes grading criteria, attendance and withdrawal policies, other important information regarding the course, and also information about disability accommodations. Be sure to download and save it for your records.